today's throwing challenge, we're going to deal with some cone heads. Hey class, welcome back. Mr. G here, your online art professor. So today's project that we're going over is another great pottery throwdown that we're doing. Again, if you can't, if you haven't watched it yet, it's on uh, HBO Max. It's a great British pottery show. I'm doing my own take on it. Why? Because I got a camera, I got some clay, let's make some stuff. So today's piece that we're going into is the cone shape. Now, why is the cone shape important? Because we want to showcase how we can close a vessel in a different way. So if you've made a bottle shape before where you've thrown the cylinder and you've brought that cylinder up, you then have to collar in the section at the top to create that bottle neck, the bottle shape, and you have to bring the clay back in. What happens if you bring the clay in all the way? When you do this, you want to have that proper seal of where the clay is completely touching using a wooden rib or a metal rib or a plastic rib or one of those red uh, the rubber kidneys and you're smoothing out the exterior of the piece so that you have a nice even seal at the top and you can bring that all the way down to the shape keep that structure firm and together so that it doesn't uh, come apart in the kiln now remember as there is trapped air inside of there so you want to make sure that how how will it be vented out is it completely empty at the bottom because some people use these for lots of different objects which could be either an ornament uh for christmas time if you're using this for an ornament decoration for that you can use it as a bell shape uh for me i'm using it as a double vessel which i'm going to get to an, in the next video after this so stay tuned for that but there's a lot of different aspects of how we can take that cone shape and apply it to different other other avenues in ceramics All right, that's where I'm gonna be ending class today, guys. I hope that you got something fun out of this experience. Again, great pottery throwdown. The people that I'm finding online on IG, go check out their websites. I'm putting all their links in the descriptions below as well as uh, the great pottery throwdown. I think they have a YouTube channel even. Go out there, show some love to these guys. Try and get pottery more into the, into the wheelhouse of everybody that we come across i love clay it's my thing i definitely want to do more of it and i definitely going to continue to do more of it so pausing on class today but before we go let's go not forget our homework which is like subscribe share and all the various platforms get the message out there to as many teachers friends students we possibly can educate the masses that is always my goal uh don't forget if you guys had a question comment or concern raise your hand in the comments below happy to answer those questions with my classmates as always i will see you guys next class so until then later guys